which basically is only three things. Side body long, softening the upper back, filling out the lower back. That's great. Keeping that situation stretched up to downward facing dog. All the way. And I can help the heart to stay a little bit more integrated, which is all about that heart softening. Well, it speaks to the heart, which is also nice and reminds you this about something different than just physical, you know, like, you know, bones and muscles. But it creates a shoulder integration. Brings the shoulder into that thing. Good. Which one is your kicking thing? She knows. If you don't, if they don't know, if the students don't know, if you don't know, you lift it up and feel it. Just, just demonstrate that. This one there, you can feel it. Does that feel like the one? Not sure. Bring it down. Lift the other one. Feel it. So it comes from a feeling. You know, you feel which one is the easiest one. And in the beginning, I would, I would let students kick up with your easy one. For those of you who've done this a lot of times, I will say, Exactly. With your easy one, with the not so comfortable one, start keeping up more with that one. Otherwise, you're creating more imbalance. You get very good at keeping with one, you get one that's very awkward. Which one do you want to keep with? The right. The right. Step your left forward, the foot forward a little bit. And then you keep your knees in the bent, your heel high, like that. So you have a little spring effect on this side. This one is going to stay straight and strong. And you're going to kick, you're going to lift it up. See, I'm going to stand there and hold your hips. So everything's going to go just fine. You're going to do one, two, three. So swing it up one, swing it up the second time, swing it up the third time. But don't bend it, don't bend it. Just lift it. Lift it one, two, and swing on three. Wow. See, my head went to the side. <laughs> I avoided being kicked in the head. This is part of it. Great, she's doing great. I'm holding her hips. And then my hands, I don't do much on the stand. What? I don't do much on the stand. She has her arms. She says no strength in her arms. No strength in her arms. Yeah. Does she look weak? She's shaking on one side. She's shaking. Yeah. Which side? Left side. Left side. Left side. Yeah. Your left arm is shaky. Why do you think it's shaky? Right arm. My elbows are kind of heavier than that. Soften your elbows a little bit. A little more muscular power into the arms. She has high mobility and yeah. That's why she feels a little unstable. Stretch out. Find your, find your tailbone. Okay, that's a hard thing. Find your tailbone. Stretch your tailbone all the way up to your leg bones, all the way up to your heels. Now she's getting extension. See? Nice. Now she focused on her energy from here to here. She forgot about the arms. She became much happier. <laughs> One leg down. Which one? Which one do you like? 